From the KHMO, KHMORadio.com newsroom, I'm Bill Schuler. Malaysian trial of two women accused of killing the North Korean leader's half-brother is concluded for the day with a visit to the airport to where he was attacked. The suspect's judge and others were escorted inside the Kuala Lumpur airport by armed police on a tour meant to give the court a better perspective of events as they unfolded. That trial returns to the courtroom on Wednesday. Local and regional news, officials with Quincy University announced a new academic scholarship model for freshmen and transfer students. Under the program, prospective freshmen and transfers will be able to calculate an academic award based on high school GPA and their ACT, SAT scores. Transfer students can estimate their scholarship based on their GPA and the number of transferable credits completed. QU officials say they're investing in the school's future by investing in their students. Pickup crash at 344 Monday afternoon along US 61 and Hannibal near route MM injures the driver. Hannibal police say a southbound pickup driven by 98-year-old Hannibal man made a rapid turn from 61 into the Casano's parking lot. The vehicle then traveled uh, north and went through a chain link fence before striking the KFC building. Police say the driver was uh, transported from the scene by Marion County Ambulance. Police say that crash remains under investigation. From the KHMO, KHMORadio.com newsroom, I'm Bill Schuler.